Hi guys, Tori here. I'm back with To The Moon. And this will be part six. I have to think about it then. <laughs> um, I've just finished the puzzle. Just as I finished the last episode. So let's activate this memento and get started. It is a letter but I can't read it just yet for some reason. Let's go and have a have a nose and see what it's all about. Oh. I'm going a little bit further back. Not that much though. Oh, look at the sunset. Autumn. Which is kind of weird because it's autumn at the moment. <laughs> Crikey nutcrackers! I don't think they were expecting to land up there. You aren't Australian! Who cares? We're like 20 billion nanometers off the ground standing on a damn flagpole. It's not a just jump down. It's not like you can be hurt here. Are you kidding me? It's a freaking skydive. Yeah. You can't stay on here. You can't get off. God, I hate it when this happens. I swear, if this place... Eva! What the fuck? <laughs> Why would they abandon her like this? Oh, so is Anya the, the lighthouse? What? Uh, maybe. I suppose she's just no longer needed. No longer needed? By chips, I mean. You know how it is. Now that everything has GPS and all that. Not that that helps with anything, believe me. GPS always takes you the wrong route. Look, River. This place means a lot to me too, and I've been thinking. In our current state, things have been pretty stable. If we save well, in a few years, we could afford to build a house on top of here. We'd be able to see her from the window. In the morning, at night, we'd always be nearby. here any time. She'll never be alone again, John. I'll be able to watch over her every day. Yeah, we will. Good for them. You've got to be kidding me. Remember what happens, don't you? It's like watching a train wreck. The ending isn't any more important than any of the moments leading to it. True. The, the important 
important thing is that over here they are happy. Let's move on. referring to the lighthouses, aren't you, weren't they? I suppose so. Then, that river, she declined treatment for the sake of a lighthouse? Isn't that a bit too extreme? I've seen stranger things in the course of the job. Me too, but... Uh. I can never wrap my head around it. It's none of our business anyway. She's not our client. Well hidden, I didn't see that. Little bunny rabbit. the rabbit in the moon. Is that in oh yeah it's even younger river <coughs> so the whole paper rabbit thing goes back quite a while yeah and even further back hmm can I look at anything no nope
music and the sounds in this game are just amazing. I love the sounds of the sea and bird song at the moment. Ah, is that new boxes of plain paper? Origami paper? Uh oh, I think I know where this is going. Yep. Can I get a piano? An old baby grand piano. How the heck did they move this thing upstairs? It's a good question. Who knows by better to be a piece of cake for the TARDIS? Yeah, not really. You can't even get it through its door. Hmm, true. Well, that settles it. Moving pianos is a pain in the ass for everybody. It's probably taken an entire episode to get it inside. I wouldn't mind seeing such an episode. <laughs> Me neither, it sounds pretty epic. Any Doctor Who fans here? I'm not really a fan myself. I've watched a few episodes, but I can't really get into it. We went out for a haircut this early in the morning. What are you making there? Did you see the rabbit I left for you? Yeah. Tell me about that rabbit. Huh? Describe the rabbit. Um, it was yellow. And well, it's just a paper rabbit. I don't know how else to describe it. You're acting strange, River. Is something wrong? River? She looks really tired as well. I don't know about you, but I'm getting some inverse deja vu. I think I know of her condition, but this is rather odd, even for that. I think she's... Do you? Perhaps. Who knows? But, like you said, she's not our client. Let's just get what we're paid for over with. Mm. Long strands of orange hair. Oh, yeah, she had a haircut, didn't she? Oh, that's the right So, this is the day she started it, huh? Thank you. 
up with me guys So we're, let's have a look, yeah, a little bit further back, but this is where the house used to be, isn't it? Used to be? The house that never, never should have been. I mean, really? What is it about unusually high and dangerous places that attract people? Oh, the views, maybe. All those pretty views. I love heights. I really, really do. Let's go and have a... Oh. Have a look at the night first. Acrophobia. Something that Johnny and River apparently didn't have. <laughs> no. Oh, thank you. I don't think I've been this way. Have I? Or has it just changed again? Ah, no, no, down here. I just jumped over one side and then jumped back over. Probably. Yeah, yeah, I have. Sorry, guys. Just taking a miniature circular detour. There's where I'm meant to go. me back then. Yeah. What about now? I suppose it's just part of it. Look, it was a long time ago. It's not too relevant now. But is it that I should tell you the truth? I shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. Hmm? 
What? <laughs> what is that? A hacky sack? What is... Can you throw this as far as where Angie's at? I don't know. You want me to try? Would you? River! Are you insane? Get away from there! <laughs> oh, she's definitely not scared of heights. I think this memory isn't too far from the last. I think they may be connected. Probably. Right, I'm going to leave that episode here, guys, and I'll be back soon with some more. Thank you for watching. Bye!